today. And Gleesey is around 10 or so, somewhere in the early 10s. And so this is going to be a good round two, I think. Yeah, Gleesey's. I am really curious. What is Day Ray? Which character is Day Ray going to go I for? would assume he's going to use Falco, but I don't know. Fox or Falco? He might be using. Well, he hasn't changed yet. He's going Mario. Okay, interesting. I like that. I, I I believe I've heard that Mario does well because he can. He doesn't have to approach. He's got the fireball, and um, certainly has good conversions on a fastball like Mother. Yeah, to me, this is in Mario's favor. Mm -hmm. But the way that Blazy plays, he does not. When he gets a good conversion going, he does not screw up his shuttle loop combos. He is so efficient at doing them. And off stage, he doesn't do stupid stuff. He'll just go for a bear or a nair so that he can come back. He just is making so much progress with, as a player and with his character. Okay, and they're just kind of feeling out each other early on. Look for Daybreak's Mario to go for a lot of kind of like fade back to grabs, and then um, a lot of bears in the neutral. Oh, he just caught that roll. And um, Meta Knight not to be counted out though with Rage. Okay, up, up air to Nair. Then trying to overextend. Really smart. Okay. And I think what um, Daybreak is doing right now so efficiently and why Glaze is having a hard time getting in is he's just throwing out a few more hitboxes then. Yeah. And that's making a big difference right now, honestly. Whoa. Oh, he caught that air dodge. Okay, that was cute. Okay, he could be in trouble. Okay, yeah. good bear to get out. Mario has pretty good options. Oh, just, oh he wanted to grip on the yeah. there. And if you get the first stock on Meta Knight, such a relief, honestly, for almost every character. If you can get that, you force him to... Because Meta Knight doesn't have great... He's got... His approach options and B1s are good, but he doesn't have many, if that makes sense, you know? Yeah, Mario could just weigh out his dash attack or something like that and just grab him. Just, that's just like a free, what, 20%? Mm -hmm. So if you can get that first stack off Mario, that is a great... Or off... Uh, or, ah, Meta Knight, that's a great feeling because you don't have to worry so much about losing to something like an up air string. So up here. Daybreak with some up bears of his own to an up. Yeah. <laughs> Mario special. And again, these hitboxes are what's giving Glacy a really hard time right now. I like the idea of that counter, but not quite getting it. And it's got similar knockback to his F smash, Meta Knight, surprisingly. Oh, oh no. Man. And I don't think Glacy was too happy with it. It's kind of unfortunate. But hopefully, Glacy can slow things down, bring it to a possible game three. I like to see him do well. It's definitely a play that's been putting in a lot of work and improving very quickly. I mean, Daybreak is also getting better, but Daybreak's at a slightly higher level right now, and just he's gotten a little bit more consistently currently. At least he's sheep. Interesting. He has so, a sheep? I didn't know about it. But um, we'll see. He just may not be feeling comfortable in the matchup. Sheep does pretty well against Mario. Not as well as she did pre-patch. I think it was a much more even matchup. But let's see Glacy sheep. Ooh. Nice pivot. Okay. And I see Glacy playing a lot more evasive, which is how you should play Sheik, honestly. Yeah. Bait your opponent in and when they do and condition them with needles to do your bidding and get better conversions. Okay. I really Whoa. Oh, okay, good get up attack though. That was a nice RAR up air. Daybreak likes that RAR up air with a lot of his characters. Something to look out for. He does it with Falco, can lead it to myself. And I know he does it with Mario, too, and that might lead to something good, too. Okay, down throw. Up air. He caught that double jump, it looked like. Oh, he went for the up yeah. smash there. And he almost got the read, but the, again, these hitboxes that Daybreak is throwing out, kind of overwhelming Glacy in both matchups, just a little bit, you know? Okay. Glacy Sheik looking very clean right now. And. You know, he may have figured out some stuff about Daybreak's Mario, but Daybreak has not played Glazy Sheik as far as I'm aware, so. Not it. Oh, no. Town and City. Yep, Town and City did him, did him dirty there. And I think he DI'd that right, but it may have been slightly off DI. He may have thought he was winning all the way. I'm not sure. It was close, either way. Good up smash, though. That was such a good challenge. I think no Sheik hardly, except, you know, Mr. R, the really going to avoid, uses up smash. Enough. Uh, Is that it? Oh my god, he just got a fair. Wow. Okay. Daybreak taking it with the fair. And um, it's up to Daybreak. Definitely showing his um, anti side. He's got a lot of characters that have gotten results in the tourney, you know? How many characters? Okay.